So we'll see how this goes for him. <clears throat> he is going K rule today. I wouldn't be surprised to see the switch to Bowser if this doesn't work out, but this may well yeah. work out. Yeah, I mean, speaking of oppressive, I mean, Ness in general was an oppressive character. <laughs> you yeah, just get combo to high heaven, especially as a heavy. Mm -hmm. well, we might be able to and here to we go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he, he missed the re grab on his combo there. Oh my gosh, yeah. the start oh, out. No. Oh, load. Yeah, that's, that hurts. That's like a quick 50%. Uh, Oh, my oh no, that was a really did he just strange SD? SD. Oh dang! Yeah, what did like he do? A... Up air or something off stage? Or... I'm not sure. He just kind of fast fell like really, really yeah. fast, and then just didn't do anything. That's a yeah. shame. Oh, I think bad. maybe he lost his jump early, so and didn't really realize. Maybe. Tried to fast fall. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. the thing sucks. is with like King K rules aerial, some of them really last a long time. Like his up oh, air yeah. stays. His up air because they didn't want you being able to up air into up B people. They made him like do this laugh afterwards. But like it makes it so the move lasts so long and if you do that off stage you just die you know oh my, oh my god that was the perfect timing on the yeah. spot dodge of the down smash and then mm -hmm. just went straight into it and oh god you're gonna eat a pk flash yeah this is looking really hard for tetsu i think he's gonna we're gonna see the character switch to be honest yeah oh, oh that I was a really it. nice he, he just ran at his shields waited yeah. for the option and then and you know, jumped yeah jump, the where he short hopped over the grab and then um and then up headed that was really cool yeah that was a really uh smart play <laughs> Tetsu had the read there, but he just wasn't. I think he hesitated just a little bit. Yeah. Uh, uh. Oh god, he, he's going for the, uh, the PK yeah, he's rocket. Go, he's going for the crazy stuff now. He, like, Blue Boy wants the rocket. Mm -hmm. He already mm. got one off this stock. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, nice tech, tech, though. Yeah, good tech. I would have fucked that up for sure. <laughs> that's that's the skill check. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and there we go. Oh. I don't know what that was. I think that was up till. Yeah, I was still <laughs> traded with the magnet, weirdly, but. Yeah, uh, that was so strange because, like, K Roll. To the naked eye, basically, just kind of stayed in place as Ness flew off the screen. <laughs> it looked really yeah, funny. Yeah, pretty much. There's was like one frame where like, up tilt came out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All oh, the back throws. Okay, yeah, there's the back row. Yeah. I didn't catch the percentage, but I assume it was high. <laughs> That's the kind owner of what Ness boys. does. We love PK yeah. back throw. We love PK back throw. Don't get grabbed because. <laughs> yeah. Yikes. That was, that was kind of rough for uh, Tetsu, I can't lie. I think he's gonna yeah. might want to switch to the Bowser, but he might want to stay cable. Maybe he's got some stuff figured out. Maybe, but I, I don't know. I feel like Bowser has better tools to kind of deal with Ness in general. I think that forward air in, in general stuffs out uh, Ness jumping, which and is like obviously way better. he has he has tough guy for PK fire as well, which is quite a big deal. Yeah, which is very helpful. Yeah, mm -hmm. I definitely take the Bowser matchup over the K roll matchup any day. I would, yeah, I would. I think they're both kind of bad, though. <laughs> they're not. They're not ideal. I don't know. Like, I, I, I think like, I think ne I think Ness Bowser's even personally as a Bowser player. Yeah, yeah Bow Ness Bowser even. I can see that. Yeah. Like, if if it's losing for Bowser, it's only slightly. Yeah, 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 for sure. It can it's be really bad. hard to land because of PK Thunder. You can't really do anything about it. But like with yeah. Nair being like a not a terrible move now, it's a little bit better. But either way, yeah, he's actually sure. sticking with the K rule. So we'll see sticking out with the K rule. I mean, he did SD the second stock. Which That's true, fun. yeah. So maybe he's kind of starting to feel something. I wish I could mm -hmm. feel something again. But here we are. <laughs> but here we are. Dead inside <laughs> as always. Yikes. Okay. Oh, I like that. I like that little uh, wave, wave land from Tetsu. Actually manages to get a little bit of a st something started. Uh, yeah, the F-Tilt okay. are so good against like a move like Ness Forward Air. Because Ness Forward Air mm -hmm. obviously a multi-hit. Each individual hit doesn't do that much damage. So it's not going to do too much damage to uh, K. Rool's armor. And the, like, well, like, the F2 armor in general is just insane. Yeah. It lasts so long. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it seems to last like right from the beginning right to the very end. And it, and like the actual forward tilt itself has so much range. I think that's one of Carol's best moves. Um, like, because the fact that you can like pivot cancel it out of a run as well is really nice. But I love that edge guarding from Blue Boy there. That yeah, was... I mean, PK Thunder is just gonna bully Carol off stage all day. There's not really anything that uh, Carol can do to mix up the recovery, so... Oh my god, but these these combos, I have a feeling like... I know Tetsu picked this stage, but I have a feeling Blue Boy likes this stage because of how far he can just carry uh, Carol horizontally with like his forward edge yeah. and his uh, magnets and stuff like that. Oh no, I, I, he wanted the platform, but he missed it. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Yikes. But that's going to give uh, Tetsu a chance to uh, get this Maybe game back. Maybe even things up. Ooh, uh, I think he... I mean, all, wait, all he needs he armor three? Good hits. That looked really weird. Yeah, they just bounce uh, no, each I think other. He I think he had dodged for it. Oh, okay. The, uh, yeah. I was going to say, because I feel like that probably would have broken his armor if he got PK flashed on it now that I think about it. Yeah. No jump. Okay, he's forced to recover high, but yeah. I mean, he's still got no jump here, so... 
Okay, he, like, I saw uh, Blue Boy trying to wait out the option there, but just kind of got caught by that huge neutral earth. Mm. Oh, going a bit low, but oh, it doesn't really matter. For, oh, yeah, that weird yeah, air dodge. No. Yeah, I think I think he, that was just a late tech. And yeah, then late he got tech. Buffered and buffered. Because, uh, yeah, that's kind of how Smash Ultimate works sometimes, unfortunately. You can just kind of buffer air dodge out of bad things. I don't mind like air dodging after missing attack though, because I feel like it's it's more of a punish for like trying to you know well not timing it properly. Yeah. I mean I on, online it Ooh. sucks. I like that though. I like that well, the uh, the like just straight up like cooling out of the uh, of the like drift in and just up airing him straight up. I like it. And now it's practically even, you know. So yeah, that was a really good play by Tattoo. Mm -hmm. Definitely still in this. Yeah, but I mean it's gonna be difficult. Yeah. Ugh. I was gonna say though, like he can just. It carried us so much damage, man. Yeah, for sure. Ooh, yeah, um, this like hard. this is pretty much. This is really hard for K. Rock. He needs to land, man. I yeah, think he, he should be. Now. I do think he should be trying to armor through the PK Thunder rather than. Oh, that's gonna be death, surely. Yeah, it's definitely gonna be dead. Yeah. Yeah, I th for sure. I think he could be trying to nair through these um, PK Thunders rather than air dodge through them because. Hmm. 